Say all right, so first and foremost, want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahushai, Ba'ashem, Rekhah, Kodash. We say that we are the pastors and elders of great mountain and rural, will teach us about pastors and the truth. And we say salutations, so all the items of the people who want to turn to the day and day out, you know, constantly in season, the season, we say shalom. You know, once again, going into all the video, and let's basically touch on upon, you know, this is this is a rapper called Kevin Gates. And somebody thinks he was saying, he's known to be a person that speaks some, basically speaks bullshit. You understand but to the world he speaks you know to, to them he seems like, like an enlightened one to the world he seems like an enlightened one you know when you speak they, they, they listen you know he, he talking sense and basically it's, it's bullshit he's speaking now these are the men that jakes have have a, have um in high authority these, these are the men that they look up to these are the men that they put on a pedestal and so many things he said in this video here where he would make a man smash his girl you know he got a tree some he, he smash another man um you 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 watch another man why all this that stuff he was going into and it's basically you know all the things that he mentioned is is is, is breaking the law you know idolatry you know he committed and so forth and and again the way how we the way how we speak you now th this this is one of the things i'm going to go into the way how we speak to a simple turn he, he will sound like he's a man of much wisdom or he's a man of much you know understanding a man of much truth when it's not so he just he just know how to talk right and that is how we just sketch. Um, that is how we just sketch some of these jigs, the way how you speak, you know. For example, I'm gonna play a piece of the video here. Oh no. But, but no no, you is said you said to young Miami, you were like, yo, if you go sleep with somebody, bring the video back that right. we can watch. And I'm like, hold up, man. You're my favorite porn star, what up? Nah, that's, well, that's my homies like no, you gotta ask me if he's because they said that's like white people cuck stuff. Cause that's what I guess so. You understand it's some kind of blasphemous stuff talking about um you know he girl could go and sleep on another man and she could bring the video home and it's, it's, it's it, again it's a whole sort of a whole sort of messiness a whole sort of um sin that was mentioned in this video and, and the, again the way how he speak the way how you you know the way how he answers the question to a simple turn that knows nothing or to these people in the world to the jake in the world he would seem like a man with much wisdom now this is isaiah chapter 9 verse 16 it says, for the leaders of these people cause them to err, and they that are led of them are destroyed. Because why? They, 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 the leaders of these people cause them to err, right? To err. And th this is an example, because th this is who Jake put up to be the leaders. This is who they look up to. This is who the, who, this is who they worship. So the scripture says, for the leaders of these people cause them to err, and they that are led of them are destroyed. And it, this is a perfect example. Now we have people who are believing in him, believing in things he's speaking about, believing in things he's saying, and it's basically nonsense. So they that are led of them are what are destroyed. They that the, the, the men that go down that path, the men that that men that believe in are, are going to be what destroyed. That goes for that that goes for majority of, of the leaders that, that, that Jake put um that Jake have over them. You know? The the leaders of the people cause them to error. Error in the ways causing them to sin. Like this this listening to this video alone, you can hear also that I also that wickedness. But again, the way how you speak to, to uh, the way you speak to a simple tongue, he will seem like he's he talking sense when it's not that, right? When it's not that at all, it's not that at all, right? Um, as I say, the one they're going to is how he speak, and let's show you. I just have to say, listen to how a man speak first, right? So let me go to that. This is the book of um. This is the book of Ecclesiastes, chapter 27, verse 7. It says, um, matter of fact, <laughs> all right, so let me start from verse, um, this is the book of um, Ecclesiastes, chapter 27, I'll start from verse 1. They say many have sinned for a small matter, and he that seeketh for abundance will turn his eyes away. And say nail stick it fast between the joinings of the stones, so doth sin stick close between buying and selling. Right? So there's the things. It says so doth sin stick close between buying and selling, right? It says, unless a man hold himself diligently in the fear of the Lord, his house shall be overthrown, as when one sifted with a with a the deceived, the, the refuse remaineth, so the filth 
of a man in his talk. So you say, as one that suffered the, the sea, I say, you're suffering, and they say they refuse remain, and so they refuse go remain because they're suffering. They say, so the filth of a man in his talk, and they could see the filth here. You could see the filth. So the filth of a man in his talk, and they could hear it in his talk, the filth in his talk. Talking about, you know, a girl could go and sleep the next man and she could bring him the video. They felt. They felt. It said the furnace, it said the furnace proved the potter's vessels. So the trial of a man in, in his reasoning is in his reasoning. The fruit declare it if the tree have been just. So the utterance of a conceit in the heart of man. It said, Praise no man before thou hearest him speak, for this is the trial of men. So he said, praise no man before thou hearest him speak. And when you hear these, when you hear these men speak, you can, you can literally hear it. these men not supposed to be praised. Going back to for the leaders of the feet of the people cause unto air. So you know, you know even the post had these men over in us who not even supposed to be praising these men. But these men just but Jake, they praise these men. Why? Because they have money. They have all this stuff. Now when they hear when they hear these men talk, they be like, wait, wait. You know what? I shouldn't put this man. I shouldn't. You know I shouldn't put this man on a pedestal. He kind of shit he speaking. So that is scripture here. Praise no man before thou hearest him speak, for this is the trial of man. Right? So praise no man before you speak. Right? So, so, so again, some of the people that we don't want to do is, 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 is just praise people. You know, they have money. Yeah, you he he good. He, the things he doing good. You know, the, he, he need praise. He need he need to put on a pedestal. He need to be above us. You know. They say praise no man before you cut your head. He kind of shit he's speaking here. But I got a big long dick, so I ain't tripping on it. Like, so you wouldn't be mad if another man penetrated a woman you were interested in or dealing with. No, because that's just dick. Me and her have a psychokinetic relationship. Okay, so you hear the kind of <laughs> psycho, you hear the kind of madness, you hear the kind of sharpness that being speak, but uh, but uh, some, but some, as I say, they, they will eat up those words, right? And I'm going to go down to verse Ecclesiastical Psalm um, 27 here. It said that verse 11, I'm going to go to verse 11, right? It said that the scores of a, of a godly man is always with wisdom. The discourse of a godly man is always with wisdom. And there's no there's no wisdom here. So you know this is not this is not a godly man. This is not even somebody who's supposed to be praised. No nope, not even listening to. So you say the discourse of a godly man is always with wisdom, but a fool change it as the moon. You say if thou be among the, the indiscreet, observe the time, but be continually among men of understanding. So that is who you're supposed to be listening to. You're supposed to be listening to men of understanding men again and who that would be the men of the lord is who you're supposed to be listening to but these men you ain't supposed to be paying attention to them right let's say this let's say um let's say if thou be among the indiscreet observe the time but be continually among men of understanding they say the discourse of fools is irksome the discourse of fools is irksome so yes yeah, so here in this discourse here in this 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 conversation here is is is, is it irksome only look up the meaning of irksome, right? Let's get a quick Google search here. It say irritating, annoying. That do, that, that we mean by irksome. It say irritating. So the discourse, so the discourse is uh, it, it, it irritating, it annoying. They hear these men speak these 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 blasphemous shit. These, you know this this I want that sin, right? They say the discourse of fools is irksome, and their sport is in a wantonness of sin. And it, all the things he mentioned in here is the wantonness of sin. So that make him more a fool, even though you try to use these big words, you know, psychological and psyche and all this other madness. That is just to catch people. You know, that is just to catch a simple term. So they say that the discourse of fools is irksome and the sport is the wantonness of sin. That is the sport. The sport is, 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 is sin. That is why when I, when I listen to this video, he talk about watching sleep with another man. Why? If he ain't talk about... Um, a man sleeping with his wife, three son, you know, they all this is a madness. The, 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 and their sport is the wantonness of sin. Right? Let me tell you, 
But go back to the go back to the go back to the verse seven and say, Praise no man before thou hearest him speak. For this is the child of man. He, 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 listen to them. Just listen to them. And it's madness. Madness. Right? Um so I'm gonna bring this piece up here. I'm gonna bring this next piece up here in Proverbs. Proverbs chapter what um Proverbs chapter fourteen. Proverbs chapter fourteen um Yeah, and the NID had to learn to control your tongue. That is why even the Lord said to what? To make your answers be ye or nay. You understand? <laughs> no, no more. Right? Um, right, this is Proverbs chapter 14, verse 12. Right? It says, it say, There is a way which seemeth right unto a man, but the end thereof are the ways of death. And that is just, you know, to him, it, it seemed like that is the right way. You know, as we talking about, I mean, you know, if you want to do that, I have no problem with that psyche and all this sort of madness. The, there is a way which seemeth right unto a man, but the end thereof are the ways of death. So the end the way of this way is death. So I was going back to the, going back to the, to the Isaiah, they let a lot of them are what? Destroyed. Are destroyed. Right? Are destroyed. This is um so you see um I'm jump to the book of um Ecclesi- going back to the book of Ecclesiasticus. You understand? This is the book of Ecclesiastic Ecclesiasticus chapter one verse verse twenty nine, right? It say be it say be not an hypocrite in the sight of men and take good heed what thou speakest. Take good heed to what thou speakest. So it's just, hey, that is why we, we pay attention to what it is we say. That is why it's better to to, to hear first. You know to listen and then speak but there's, there's an opposite they, they, they just speak they can't control the tongue so they're just speaking you know that is scripture tell you about the way it's supposed to be it said be not a hypocrite in the sight of men and take good heed what thou speakest take good heed to what thou speakest so that's why we, we're not supposed to be with conversation we're supposed to be what holy so when you're speaking you hear holy you hear holy stuff not this sort of shit that these men speaking here Right? Same, same book of Ecclesiastes chapter 22, right? The book of Ecclesiastes chapter 22, verse um, 22, verse um, the book of Ecclesiastes chapter 22, verse um, 8. It's a he that he that. I say, he that telleth a tale to a fool speaketh to one in his slumber. When he had told his tale, he will say, what is the matter? And all these things just, hey, a tale. This is the book of Ecclesiastes, same Ecclesiastes chapter 23, verse 8. It say, the sinner, it say, it say, um, That's not, let me start from verse, um, um, let me start from verse, let me start from verse 7, the book of Ecclesiastes chapter 23, verse 7, it says, Hear, O ye children, the, 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 the discipline of the mouth, he that keepeth it shall never be taken in his lips. So you have to keep a discipline with your mouth, you have to know how you speak, know the things you say and so forth, discipline. But these men don't have that. They just believe they just pure whatever it is that come to their mind. You know, making themselves look foolish. Right? 
It says, it says hear, o, hear, O ye children, the, the discipline of the mouth. He that keepeth it shall never be taken in his lips. The sinner, the sinner shall be left in his foolishness. Both the evil speaker and the proud shall fall thereby. Both the evil speaker, both the evil speaker and the proud shall fall thereby. So there's only one, there's only one road. So, so um, someone like who speaks like this going down, and there's a fall, there is death, there is destruction. Right? There is destruction. For the NAD, do 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 listen to these men, right? Do listen to these men, because only there's only one way, there's only there's only um one thing to speak, and they sin, there is evil, you know, evil. Right, evil. I'm gonna jump to one last scripture here, and I will close off. This is Matthew chapter twelve, verse, verse thirty-six. Matthew chapter twelve, because again, we could are going through some of the laws and some of the things you are saying, showing that you could, showing that's just saying these things is like breaking the laws, you know. To doing these things is is, is some of the some of the things you say is it's worthy of what death. But I just want to talk on the way how these men speak and how proud did they speak. And the scripture say, as, as we now read, the evil speaker and the proud shall what? They shall fall. Right? This is Matthew chapter 12, verse 36. It say, um, it say, it say, um, it say, but I say unto you that every idle word that men shall speak, they shall give account thereof in the day of judgment. For by thy words thou shalt be justified, and by thy words thou shalt be confronted. So your idle words, so every idle word a man speak, he shall have to give a comfort. You understand? And let's hear the things he's speaking here. You watch this video, as I say, it irks some, it 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 irks some, it get mad, it 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 irritating, it annoying, you know? Hey, so with that we give all praises and all glory to Yahweh, by Hashem, you know, Shai, by Hashem, you know, for that. We said, I'm going to say, Pastors and Elders agree with us, and the rule of teachers are first in the shoot. I'm going to say, Salutations, so the Akron's official, and she's going to say, Dean and the out, you know, constantly in season and season, we say, Shalom.